This is our Overland setup. It is an M1101 military Humvee trailer modified for camping and towed by a Toyota Tacoma. Today we're going to remove the Humvee trailer wheels, tires, and hub assembly to replace them with a setup that matches the truck. Let's go! So we are removing the Humvee tires, wheels, and hub assembly which comes standard with the trailer and installing a set which accommodates the wheels and tire combination of our 2012 Toyota Tacoma. The Humvee trailer comes with large 37 inch tires and wheels with 8 by 6.5 lug patterns. We will replace it with 33 inch tires and Dexter hubs with 6x5.5 lug patterns and allowing the wheels from the truck to fit the trailer and vice versa. First you want to remove the tires. Next you want to remove the grease cap to access the cotter pin and the castle nut inside. With the needle nose pliers, you want to remove the cotter pin so you can turn the castle nut. You can pull on the hub assembly to push the outside bearing out, making it easier to remove. From here, you can wiggle the whole thing out. Then you want to unbolt the back plate, leaving only the spindle. Here I used a wire brush drill attachment to remove as much rust as possible. You want to mask the spindle and paint all other exposed bare metals. Bolt on the new back plate. Use thread lockers to make it more secure. Pack grease into your bearings. Next, you want to properly seat your inner bearing behind a grease seal. Place the new hub over the spindle and ensure it seats all the way back. Place the outer bearing 
the washer, and the castle nut. Make sure the castle nut is snug, but not tight. Don't forget to replace the cotter pin to keep the castle nut from spinning. Add the grease cap and you're ready for the wheel. This modification made our setup more streamlined. We can bring spares that work for both the truck and the trailer. It also allows for the flexibility of using the trailer tires as spares in an emergency if more than one of the truck tires get damaged on the trail. If you have anything to add or if you have questions, please leave it in the comments. Thank you for watching.